Hey everybody, welcome to tonight's close-up stream. I thought we would start here with Quiche Lorraine, our mom cat. She's doing pretty well. She's, uh, she's an interesting mom cat though. She doesn't ever really want to play with her toys or any of the other things in the room. All she wants to do is get pets, eat, and uh, hang out in her little cat tree. There's nothing wrong with that, I suppose. She's busy uh, growing her little babies, so what else are you going to do? She's really sweet, though. Yes, you are pretty sweet. <laughs> It's also so busy rubbing up on me all the time, it's hard to get her face on the camera. There we go. Well, as you might know, the news of the day is that uh, our non-mom cat, um, Cashew, had her spay day today. She went to the vet, she got spayed. Uh, everything went really well. Hey, you guys. We've got Ari and uh, Headmaster Acro hanging out on the warm box. What'd you say, Acro? Bud? What did you say, Ari? You always sound like somebody's letting the air out of a balloon. Oh, I see. You guys must have been in the warm box, but it's a little too warm right now. I can feel how warm it is in there. This is a box that sits over a heat register so the kittens can get in it and be all warm if they feel like it. Which they do, but they kind of treat it like a sauna where they have to get in it and then it gets too warm and they get out for a while. And they get back in and out. They'll do that all day long. Now, I'm taking you upstairs because that is where little Cashew is recovering from her surgery today. Let's see if she's out and about where we can find her. I didn't, I didn't check on this in advance, so I don't know where she's going to be or what to expect here. Sorry. Might not get to see anything while we're up here. If I had to guess, though, oh, there she is. Yeah, we're probably not going to be able to see anything at all because she's under the bed. <laughs> she's, I don't know if you can see that. She's sitting on top of a storage container under the bed with her head up in the box spring. Cashew. Cashew, will you at least look down here? Cashew. No? That's so silly. You are just a ridiculous cat all the time. Aren't you? You guys can't see anything at all, can you? No, I guess you probably can't. She's, she's literally just sitting here with her head up in the box spring. Being so silly. That's fine. All right, we're just not going to get to see her right now. I'm not going to try to drag her out of there because she's still sore. She's on her painkillers and stuff. We'll leave her to it. That's fine. But let's go see some kittens for a minute. Can at least do that. Oh, look at this Logan bunny. Hey, bud. Hey, pal. Hi. Hi. Okay. 
There's some more Ari. Oh, sorry about that. Okay. And more acro. I see you guys moved to the kitchen in hopes that the fact that I was up meant there'd be food. Really? Is that what you think, Acro? Do you have something to say, Ari? All right, well, let's head in and have a look at some of our kittens. Hi, Gracie. Hi, Finchy. Finch is feeling much better. <laughs> you little winky Finch, did I wake you up? Finch is being subsumed into the beanbag chair here. You can see that. Oh, we got these sisters, Sassy and Chestnut. They both still need to get adopted. We're hoping that they end up getting adopted together because they really are a pair. And then, uh, as you know, Gracie's adopters actually fell through, so Gracie is also back up for adoption. And she's just a big purr monster. Can you hear that? Got a bunch of sneezes I'm hearing in here today. I don't know what's up with that. Hopefully it just stirred up some dust or something. Also, for some reason, all four of them have decided that now that I've come into the room, it's time to eat. Instead of be cute for the close-up stream. Well, Finch has got it covered, but Finch is the only one here that's already been adopted. Finch, you don't have to be cute anymore. You got your thing. You've secured your spot. <laughs> You're so adorable, though. You're like a cartoon character. Speaking of cartoon characters, well, Gracie's also like a little cloud, a little gray cloud, soft and fluffy. Gracie, hi. Hi. Did I say something to you? Hi, Chestnut. Everybody's so calm today. And even your sister, Sassy. Hi, Sassy. Oh. Sounds like dinner's arrived. DJ ordered takeout Thai, or I should say delivery Thai. They must have just gotten here, so that probably means it's a good time for me to wrap this up anyhow. You guys got all the news. Uh, oh, the one thing I wanted to mention, though, is about um, little Cashew, who did go to the vet and get fixed today. I know some folks have been kind of worried about the fact that her belly's swollen, the fact that she sits funny. So I wanted to mention the fact that we had the vet really look into both those things. They did another ultrasound and some x-rays, and they had a little look around while they were uh, operating on her. And they've really come to the conclusion that there's nothing to it. Um, she just sits funny because she's quirky. And her belly's swollen because she's got a little bit of extra weight on her. So uh, they don't think that it's anything to be too concerned about right now. Neither do I. We'll obviously keep an eye on it in case anything changes. But I think she's just a little chubby and just a little bit silly. And that's the whole story. Anyway, thanks for tuning in tonight. And uh, I, we will definitely see you later. Say goodnight, Finchie. Okay, goodnight, Finchie.